So you don't care about if my food's messed up, is what you said. Right? Right, Jose? No, I'm not saying that. Well, then I asked why my food wasn't cooked right the last couple times, and you said I'm picky, right? I'm just saying what I said and that's Wow. I got a cup holder and napkins then, dude. You don't even put did you put the bread in this time? Yeah, the first time you forgot the bread, dude. And you're asking me to make sure my food's done right. Okay, where's the gravy on the side? Did you get that in here or not? I just keep the food sometimes. Cool gravy. Figured that out at least. Um. Can I get a drink holder for the soup so I can transport it, please? Yeah. Like I do every time? And can I get extra napkins, please? So you're saying I'm being picky? No, I'm just saying... No, you said that. You said I'm being picky. If I, uh, if I work in this kind of business, mm -hmm. you think that I'm going to go to give people attitude. I don't know. Oh, mind. I'm giving you attitude by I asking to mind. have my food cooked properly. I don't mind. Like, mm -hmm. I'm, I, I don't care about that. I'm so, not like that. I'm a very easy so person. What do you do, so what do you do when someone comes and says, hey, my food wasn't cooked right? What do you do? Usually we ask them to bring the food back. or when they Like I said, now I work a 12-hour shift. There's no way I can bring the or, food back. Or then you can call. Call in and yeah, say, I've called in. and then they, they are gonna, they are probably gonna say that, or probably they will refund you your money back. You know, because I mean, you are not gonna pay for what you don't like. Already did several times. That's what I'm saying. Already like, did several yeah. times, but that's having attitude and being picky. You said. No, 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 no. No, you um, said that. Okay, well, if I said that, well, it's not. I mean, uh, that's what I'm saying. If if you are doing you something and you are paying for something that you don't like, you can get your money back. You're, you're telling me to bring it back right then. I can't. I go to a job. I can't leave for 12 hours. That's yeah. why I get food here. Yeah. But usually that's why they do it. They say, you know what, if you didn't like it. So I know, but you're telling, me to check, you're telling me to check the food when the cook should know how to cook a steak. You're saying it's picky to ask for it to be cooked medium. That's not picky. That's normal suggestion from a customer to have food made a certain way. It's not being picky. It is not. Wow. Well. But yeah, look, what? But look, look, if, uh, and you laugh at me and you think you, stuff's funny. Can no, I just I'm get extra napkins? You, you already have several times. You've been very disrespectful. Can I? And you're acting like I am. I'm the customer. You're the manager. That's what you're supposed to be. Can I get a cup holder? Yeah, can I just get your... I don't want to talk with you anymore. Can I get a cup holder for this? And can I get... And the first time I came here, you didn't even make, get the bread, remember? Didn't make the bread. That comes with it. But you didn't even apologize for that. Your other manager made up for that. Because you're kind of rude. Okay. So when I bring stuff back or I come back and say, hey, I... I had a problem with my food. You don't you don't even care to comp me a drink. Say, hey, let me get you a soda. Hey, sorry about that. You didn't even say sorry. Nothing. You, can, yeah, you, you said nothing, though. Well, that is what I'm saying. It's right? disrespectful, bro. Sure. You act like I'm being dis... You're not, though. Now you're saying sorry, now that I've called you out. That, not Your job is to go, hey, oh, you had a problem? Well, let me fix that for you. Not say, you're picky. Well, if you want stuff done a certain way, you need to check your food before you go. Why should I have to cut my steak open to make sure it's cooked right? Because you guys can't cook a steak right. I come here to eat at a restaurant and ask for my food to be cooked, and I'm paying extra amount to have the food cooked. I could go get buy a steak over there and cook it myself. So what's the point? And yeah, that's what I'm saying. Call Diana, and uh, probably if you're gonna ask if you don't like that, you can bring it by, or, or the next time if you're gonna refund your money. Hmm.
Yeah, we'll see what she says. I've already paid eight times now for steaks, and guess what? One time it's cooked right. One time. So two hundred, two hundred dollars. No, you guys need to figure out what your cook's doing then, not giving a shit about cooking the food the right way. That's messed up. And then you're putting it on me, and you forget this. First time, right? You forget my bread. I mean, we are human. Cool, I got it. I know you are. Yeah, I know you are. I was making sure I had the other condiments for the soup. I thought you guys put it in there. Yeah, I have to check that stuff. Why should I have to check that? That's your job. You're the manager. You're over there on your phone. You're sitting there saying stuff to me. You're over on your phone right when I say something to you. Watching stuff on your phone. When I was here before, you have family members or whoever over here eating and stuff. And ignoring me. I'll, that's cool. I'll show her this video. I'll show her the video where you said I'm picky and all that stuff too. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. I, I got nine million. I got nine million views on Google Maps. Nine million. I gave your other manager a good review because she was nice. You're not. She actually caught me for the bread last time. <laughs> You're not sorry, dude. That was.